Hello and welcome to the tutorial on addition. In this tutorial, we are going to learn how to add three digit numbers and ones. You can also call them units, okay? Three digit numbers and ones or units, and we're going to do this using the vertical format. Okay, let's begin with our first example. We'll start off with a nice easy one. 251 plus 7. 251 plus 7. Now you don't have to, but we're going to label the columns. We've got units, tens, and hundreds. And we, we can now go ahead and begin the addition. Where do we start? We always start on the right hand side first. So we've got 1 plus 7. What is 1 plus 7? 1 plus 7 is the same as 7 plus 1. The answer is 8. So we can write that in 8. As for the tens, we've got 5 plus 0. So that remains 5. And for the hundreds, it's the same. 2 plus 0 is 2. So 251 plus 7 is 258. That's a nice easy one. Okay, let's look at our second one. Okay, let's label the columns again. Units, tens, and hundreds. So this time we've got 473 plus 7. Now, as we always do, let's start with a column on the right-hand side first. So we've got 3 plus 7. What is 3 plus 7? Well, you should know from your number bonds and your mental arithmetic, 3 plus 7 is 10. How do we write this 10? We put 1 here and 0 over here. So we've done the units. Now let's move on to the tens. We're adding 7. There's nothing here, but there is 1 over here. 7 plus 1 is 8. And lastly, we have the hundreds. We got 4 plus 0. Well, that remains 4. So 473 plus 7 is 480. Okay, let's move on to our next one. Okay, this time we've got 688 plus 4. 688 plus 4. We're not going to label the columns in this one. Check the sign. And we always start on the right-hand side first, the one that I'm circling. So what is 8 plus 4? 8 plus 4. You should know this from your mental arithmetic, or simply count the dots. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 8 plus 4 is 12. 1 goes here, and 2 goes here. So that's 12. Now we can add the next column, the tens. We've got 8 plus 0, but we have got 1 here. So 8 plus 1 is 9. Lastly, we've got the hundreds column. We've got 6 plus 0. The answer is 6. So 688 plus 4 is 600. And 92. Okay, we've now got our final example. So we we'll just scroll down a little bit just to give ourselves a bit of room. Okay, this one we are going to label. We've got units, tens, and hundreds. Now check the sign. We've got addition. We always start with a column on the right hand side first. So we've got 4 plus 8. What is 4 plus 8? We know this 4 plus 8 because look over here. 4 plus 8 is the same as 8 plus 4. The answer is 12. Let's write that down. We put 1 here and 2 over here. Now we can add the tens. 
We've got 9 over here, nothing here, but we have got 1 here. 9 plus 1 is 10. And finally, we're going to add the hundreds. We've got 9 plus nothing is 9, but we have got 1 here. 9 plus 1 is 10. So let's put 1 here and 0 here. Now the 1 that we put at the end is part of a new column, and that is the thousands. TH for thousands. How many thousands do we have? 0 plus 0, but we have got 1 here. 0 plus 1 is 1. And that is our answer. 994 plus 8 is 1002. And it really is that simple. And that is the addition of three-digit numbers and ones using the vertical format.